So these ideas of evolution are, are threatening at a number of levels, and the first level is actually doesn't have even necessarily a whole lot to do with evolution itself. It may have things to do with uh, one interpretation of the historicity of biblical narratives, for example, the age of the earth, and that has become a very big issue uh, in the United States, although uh, issues of an old earth predate evolutionary theory substantially. So that's one, that's one whole uh, set of concerns. The other set of concerns is, is slightly deeper, actually, and it derives from uh, proposals by evolutionary theory that it leaves no room for a designer, that it leaves no room for a, a superintending uh, provid providence that directs evolutionary history. So the biblical faith, what's interesting about the, the biblical faith is it just does, doesn't just propose the existence of a god. Uh, who doesn't do anything, or even propose the existence of a God who created the universe and then went on vacation and let it uh, run. But the biblical God uh, is a God of history, the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, who has purposes for history and who not only directs it but enters history. And some articulations of evolution say, well, if you really understand evolution, um, that can't happen anymore. Uh, and some proposals have gone so far as to say that if you look at evolutionary history, there's no thematic continuity, uh, there's no directionality, there's no progression to suggest that the history of uh, the cosmos has any meaning. Now, just strictly within the, the secular interpretation of evolutionary history, um, that's changing. Uh, so that an appreciation of thematic trends, uh, trends toward complexity, uh, greater cooperativity, a series of major evolutionary transitions, uh, the theory itself is, is changing, the theoretical landscape. And it, it really doesn't seem to be inhospitable to the notion of uh, you don't have to come to this conclusion, but it is certainly concordant with the conclusion uh, that uh, of a God who uh, intended uh, evolution to be the mode of his creation.